What's up everybody? My name is Shannon and I am still waiting for my Seder and today we are talking about the second book in the Shades of Magic series, A Gathering of Shadows by V.E. Schwab. Okay, I am like so in love with this series. It is so unbelievably good. I just keep like remembering how I was like, oh, I don't think this author is for me. And now I'm like completely obsessed with this series. So we pick up four months after the events of the first book of A Darker Shade of Magic. And it took me a minute to kind of get used to it because it is very different from the first book. In the first book, we were really centered around this plot. There was a lot going on. We were saving the world. And in this one, it is more focused on our characters. We do have a new character introduced named Alucard, who is is a pirate with a little bit of a secret. He's a very interesting character. We also have Kel and Lila who have not seen each other in four months. Um, there's a lot of emotion going on there. There's a lot of unspoken said things. And there is a competition that is about to get kicked off in Red London. We do also have Lila kind of figuring out what her magic might be. There's something about her that's different. She's not like Kel, she's not like other magicians, but there's something going on with her. She's trying to figure out who she is. And I really liked this. There's no big, huge plot necessarily going on in this book, but there are some things in the background that's clearly building up towards the end. And the way Gathering of Shadow leads off, I'm like, oh my God, okay, I really need to see where we're going. I need to know what's gonna happen. I need to make sure my babies are okay. I really love the character work that's done in this book. I think we get a lot of development with Lila and especially with Kel. Kel is really going through a lot of things. Like him and his brother Rai are now tied together. Anything he does can put him in danger danger. And the way it's affecting both of them is really, really interesting because Rai feels like he can't live anymore because Kel isn't living. And if they do anything, it could cause death for the other one. Neither one of them asked for this. Neither one of them wanted this. And it's put a really big strain on their relationship. And Kel is dealing with the fact that he's supposed to be protecting everybody, but he is missing Lila and he doesn't know his place anymore. And I just really love the character work character is my favorite, especially over plot, so I really, really enjoyed this. I am giving this book an A+. I absolutely adored it. I think it was amazing. It was a little bit long, but I feel like it was paced pretty well. I think what helped that was the introduction of Alucard. He's a really, really cool character. I really hope we get to see more of him in the next book because I really, really enjoyed him, and I'm just excited to see where all of our characters are going to end up. I really want to read more from Victoria Schwab. I'm thinking about going back and rereading her YA series Series. Definitely gonna reread her um, other adult series, that's for sure. But I absolutely adored Gathering of Shadows, A plus for me highly recommend this series. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to hit that like button down below and don't forget to subscribe so you can talk books with me every week. That is everything got for you today and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.